Hello and welcome to this episode of Packet Tracer. In this episode, we want to talk about sending simple PDUs from one device to another and how we can add simple PDUs in a quick graphical way to send one shot pings from one device to another. So before you're able to send a PDU from one device to another, you need to make sure to have at least one of the ports configured with an IP address here in PC0 and also on Switch0. So I have configured these two devices with these two IP addresses and now we, want, we will be able to send PDU packets. So to send a PDU from PC0 to Switch0, first I will click on PC0 and then I will click on Switch0. Of course, when I have clicked on this button, which is the Add Simple PDU. Because when I click on the Add Simple PDU, my cursor changes to PDU, and now I can click on PC0, and again on Switch0, and two packets have been created, as you can see. Once you have created the request, the source device will queue an ICMP and also an R packet, depending how the network is configured. And both of these packets will be on queue until you press the play button or you move forward the simulation. Now, as you can see, I'm moving forward the simulation and the devices are being played and the time is going forward. And I will be able to observe the ping process. If I don't want to be confused, then I can always edit the filters and maybe remove some of the protocols from the filter. For example, maybe I would like to remove STP, then I can always do that. STP. As you can see, the STP packets are now removed and I can only see the ICMP and our packets. You can also keep track of all of the PDUs you have created here in the PDU list window. So this is the PDU list window. As you can see, my pings have failed. I'm not sure why the pings have failed, but as you can see, they have failed. The PDU list window is originally located in here. So if I toggle, as you can see, it goes to here. And if I toggle once again, it comes to here for a better view. That's it for this episode, everyone. I hope this has been informative for you and I would like to see you in the next episode. Stay tuned.